Well, yes. real estate. There was some big news that came out this week. Real estate. There was some big news, and so not to you know change the tone here, but yeah, there, there's been a very nationally important, nationally recognized uh, lawsuit uh, at, in, in the Midwest, and um, the verdict came down uh, against NAR, and it was uh, involving um, co-op fees, you know, listing agreements, uh, stuff like that, and so it just um, can you kind of um, just take a step back and and I know you're saying co-op fees and listing agreements but the lawsuit basically who was it that brought the lawsuit um it was sellers and it was a class action lawsuit uh, that involved sellers and um the plaintiffs were alleging that um that they weren't clear on how the co-op fee uh, system works and that uh, and I don't want to speak out of turn cuz I'm not mm-hmm. an expert at it but that um it, it was they felt that they didn't have a choice when it came to what they were paying in commission and um that therefore the way that the system works that the listing broker compensates the buyer's broker and it was inflating commissions you know et cetera and um n a r will be appealing that that ruling and um but it it's big because um it may or may not end up <clears throat> you know changing fundamentally how real estate operates and and I can tell you we're very very proud to be in the real estate industry mm-hmm. um real estate is one of the drivers of uh, the american economy um buying or selling a house there are so many peripheral you know things that come that come and go from the actual sale and then into the retail and then people's generating wealth and there's so much that goes into the economy that has to do with real estate so um NAR will actually absolutely defend its position um and you know for what it's worth my per- I believe that our system is a wonderful system that not only is it not anti competitive i mean it creates one of the most competitive and efficient and effective marketplaces in any industry that you can imagine i mean when you participate in the mls um you get to list your home out there for all of the buyers to see and it's highly highly competitive and it allows for the buyers to have a massive amount of choice and see everything that's available out mm-hmm. there and compare uh pricing um it allows for the sellers to reach the entire audience the buyers know right where to go to compare you know and and so they reach a a large buyer pool and so I, I think it's a very competitive and very thriving and and wonderful system is my personal opinion. You know, one of the things that, um, <clears throat> not related to the lawsuit, but one of the great things about our industry is it was a place where women were paid equally through Always. the commission structure from the beginning because there was a, a, a commission being offered to them. Yeah, and and we also take a lot of pride in real estate and being based in equality. And, Mm -hmm. you know, we are very extreme supporters of fair housing laws and equality for for all people, for all potential sellers, for all potential buyers. And you're right. It's very black and white. There isn't the opportunity to even take into consideration that somebody is is part of a particular group. I'm going to pay you differently. Yeah, Yeah. it just doesn't exist. So very, very forthright and very fair system that we are honored to be part of but you know we are willing to be agents of change but you know whatever the universe if we wake up tomorrow and then things are different we are able to adapt to being different and we will continue to serve this community and serve our clients to the best of our ability absolutely you know i think too you know when you look at real estate you mentioned the impact on the economy but it is the probably one of the best wealth building tools that we have it is. I mean, home ownership has always been considered the American dream. I mm-hmm. mean, that it's there for. They say that for a reason. It's important to building wealth. Absolutely. Well, we're cutting out to the break right now, so be sure and come back. You're listening to the I Am Real Estate Show on 10:30 a.m. KVOI, The Voice. <laughs> 